a freak for that This one goes out to the fat freak for exposing the weird creeps I'm a freak for that Let's talk about facts Cause I'm a freak for that I'm blessed in rap, yeah God know I'm a beast for that Look what the cat dragged in, let's check who's capping Fuck the semantics, I'm a pedantic You'll get way too feisty Now get off the app my special interest is to invest my time in crooks and slimes, read books, make rhymes on calling them out on their bullshit lies that are toxic kind. This is karma attack, bringing the community back. I'm a freak for that. No, I'm a freak for that. This one goes out to the fat freak for exposing the weird creeps. I'm a freak for that. Let's talk about facts. Because I'm a freak for that. I'm blessed in rap, yeah. God, no, I'm a beast for that. Look what the cat dragged in. Let's check who's capping. Fuck the semantics, I'm a pedantic. You'll get way too feisty. Now get off the app. My special interest is to invest my time in crooks and slimes. Read books, make rhymes. I'm calling them out on their bullshit lies that are toxic kind. This is karma attack, bringing the community back. I'm a freak for that. No, I'm a freak for that. This one goes out to the fat freak for exposing the weird creeps. I'm a freak for that. Let's talk about facts Woo. Cause I'm a freak for that I'm blessed in rap, yeah God know I'm a beast for that Look what the cat dragged in, let's check who's capping Fuck the semantics, I'm a pedantic You'll get way too feisty Now get off the app My special interest is to invest my time in crooks and slimes Read books, make rhymes, I'm calling them out on their bullshit lies that are toxic kind This is karma attack, bringing the community back I'm a freak for that No, I'm a freak for that out to the fat freak for exposing the weird creeps. Mm. I'm a freak for that. Mm. Let's talk about facts. Mm. Cause I'm a freak for that. I'm blessed in rap, yeah. God, no, I'm a beast for that. Look what the cat dragged in. Let's check who's capping. Fuck the semantics, I'm a pedantic. You'll get way too feisty. Now get off the app. My special interest is to invest my time in crooks and slimes. Read books, make rhymes. I'm calling them out on their bullshit lies that are toxic kind. Karma attack, bringing the community back. I'm a freak for that. No, I'm a freak for that. This one goes out to the fat freak for exposing the weird creeps. I'm a freak for that. Let's talk about facts. Cause I'm a freak for that. I'm blessed in rap, yeah. God, no, I'm a beast for that. Look what the cat dragged in. Let's check who's capping. Fuck the semantics, I'm a pedantic. You'll get way too feisty. Now get off the app. My special interest is to invest my time in crooks and slimes, read books, make rhymes, I'm calling them out on their bullshit lies that are toxic kind. This is karma attack, bringing the community back. I'm a freak for that. No, I'm a freak for that. Hey everyone, hey, hey, hey. Welcome, how's everyone doing? How's everyone doing? Well, this is an interesting one, isn't it? Um, so, we're obviously live reacting today to Rachel Skinner, who's over on TikTok. Now, uh, a quick announcement as well, guys. Over on Patreon, I am dropping YouTube videos early now. Not all of my videos, but some of them over there. Uh, you can watch all of them for as little as two quid a month. That shit's out the way. Let's move on, right? Because I feel sorry because there is a few people who do sub and I don't feel like I do enough for you guys over there. So that's what I'm doing from now on. Now we're looking at Rachel Skinner and I have had so many requests to look at this woman. Do you know what I mean? I've had so many, so many requests. Hi guys, how's everyone doing? How's everyone doing? How's everyone doing? I see a lot of people in the chat. It's nice to see you all. I will try and interact with the chat as much as I can, but it's obviously harder as the chat gets busier. Obviously, respect the mods, guys, and obviously respect each other. I don't want any infighting or any sort of bullshit. We'll have zero tolerance on any of that. Um, now, so if you haven't been to one of these live reaction streams, basically what I do is I type in the creator, I type in the creator, and then we go through the videos that are on the FYP. Unfortunately, it seems like I've taken over part of the FYP, but we'll forward past those. But I do want to talk about what she has said about me today. This is pretty funny. Um, I've never had stuff like that. 
Uh, it's quite hilarious. So, oh guys, I'm just going to pause it, right? So Rachel has found out, obviously, that this live stream has taken place. Everyone in the chat say, hey to Rachel, i got a cup for you. Um, you know she'll be watching, so definitely say hello to her. Now she's made claims that the police and the lawyers have been round. <laughs> the police and the lawyers have been round. The lawyers have travelled over from America, apparently. Um, I don't know what the hell's going on. Now, I don't do leaderboards, so... It's not for the leaderboards, is it, Rachel? No. Um, <laughs> I just honestly, it's one of the most pathetic... <sighs> sorry. It's one of the most pathetic responses I've ever had um, to people knowing I was doing a video. But anyway, let's get this show on the road. I, I know a lot of you will have seen these things, maybe, but this is the first time me seeing them. Um, I know, imagine getting lawyers around or solicitors on a Sunday. That's very interesting. Right, I will skip my videos, obviously, but we'll keep going. So it says, someone in Rachel's comments said they are going to out her for not telling the truth. And she says, so what if she's lied? Well, I feel like this may be a theme with this silly woman. She's clearly lied about the uh, lawyers, isn't she? Oh, I don't have no family members. I haven't had any for 10 years, so no one can out me. So I don't know why someone's saying, oh, two family members. What? Two family members from 10 years ago. I don't care who's suggesting that I'm not being truthful. <laughs> I mean, you're affected as hell. Like, in that comment, you're not showing that you don't give a shit at all. Com the complete fucking opposite. Let's face it. Uh, can I lift the camera up? How about that? Is that it? I didn't think this was the important part. <laughs> I couldn't give two shits, even if I wasn't. So what? What are you going to do about it? A live stream like this and highlight your bullshit? Like, it doesn't make sense to me. So what? <laughs> What do you want me to do? Go jump, like, go to the nearest cliff? Like, what? Funny you should mention that because you have made threats and suggestive comments about unaliving oneself because of the live stream and exposure. I just want you to know, Rachel, that that coercive control shit don't work on me. It doesn't work on me. You also can't mass report stuff on YouTube, so good luck with that. Um, it's very, very sad what you've done. Now, at the end of the day, we couldn't react to your bullshit if you hadn't done your bullshit. And from what I've heard, you mock people with disabilities, you've made racial comments, all sorts of things, which potentially we're going to see as we go through this. What about their mental health, Rachel? Oh, it's all about you, isn't it? All about you. So bloody what? So what? What? You, I didn't stop my viewers. So I don't know what. It's so what? So what if people are saying I ain't telling you? So what? What do you... Yeah, like someone's in the comments there saying she's not triggered yet. She's obviously triggered. It's a massive thing. Uh, it's a massive thing. What are you going to do about it? Please enlighten me. Well, she obviously doesn't like getting called out on her lies. That's what I can take away from this clip. Which is probably why she didn't want this live stream to take place. Mm. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. Like, like, good God. <laughs> this is not where I thought the reactions were going to go. Um, one second, guys. Mm. <laughs> Damn it, that's getting sound clipped, isn't it? Jesus Christ. Oh, no. Mm. I kind of, like... Is, is this just 1 minute 22 of her making these kind of noises? Because this could potentially be the hardest reaction I've ever had to do. Um. Oh, yeah. Moist. Oh, no. <laughs> 
God no! Right, get, sorry guys, live streams off. Like, fucking, um, I'm out. <laughs> I'm out. I wasn't prepared to hear us say moist. All right, while bloody making those noises. Nobody pre-warned me. <laughs> Nobody pre-warned me about this shit. I swear to God. I swear to God. Oh no! She better not say it again. If she says it again, I can't. Like, I've got headphones on. Like. Fucking okay, nobody should have that plugged into their brain. Oh, God. This... I'm only 16 seconds in. Look on your room. I thought women were a fucking mouth workout. Oh, I am blushing. Else. I, I am blushing. This is too much. I can't unhear that forever. Feel free to gift if you want a gift. Uh, where's my wallet? It'll be a fuck off. It'll be a fuck off on the gift in front. Get your cash out. No. Somebody did. Fucking, I don't know who that is, but that person needs to be checked into therapy immediately. Somebody just dropped gifts on her after saying moist. I'm going to need a monster in her. This is a workout. <laughs> no, it isn't. I get a feeling from the clips that I am going to see that your mouth does quite a lot of working out. Actually, that probably doesn't sound fucking great after what you said. And let's just, this whole clip is going to be brought up in my therapy sessions. Let's move on. Hey, hey, I'm just. Thank you hey, for guys. anyone who duetted. What is this? Why is it not playing? Play! Bloody technical problems. I'll check the comments for a sec while I'm doing this. Do -do. I'll have fun too, James. I was eating, working out. God knows. Absolutely God knows. The monster is there. <laughs> I need I need the monster, man. It's going to get me through. Right, okay. Let's go back. I'll into a girl's hotel after... <laughs> Accidentally fell into it. <laughs> I accidentally went to my hotel, got my stuff, and accidentally fell into her hotel. <laughs> what? We got Terry. <laughs> and then accidentally bumped into her in London last night. <laughs> so many accidents. We got Abby. We got Terry. The fuck is she talking about? Me too. Right, let's go a bit of teamwork, guys. We're nearly number 11. We've been number 12 for about an hour and a half. Come on, guys. Let's get Chef Dave to the top. Oh, no. Speedo, sorry. She knows what she's doing. I thought she's just playing. She's just, you know, she maybe like, I don't know, whacked a wall in her lifetime or something. But she, she knows what she's saying. She knows. Like, I oh, genuinely you, thought I she's got you mixed up. I got you mixed up. Sorry. No, I know, I know. But, no, with your jokes, though, like, I thought, like, maybe in your lifetime, that was her idea of a joke. It was fucking shit, wasn't it? Time you've run into a wall and like things ain't gone right. But you really know what you're saying, innit? You really know what you're saying. Yeah. Stalking Lucy Spraggan. Oh, God. I love Lucy Spraggan as well. I think she's great. She doesn't need this thing following her about. Because I'm funny. You are. Mm. You are funny. What, what do you mean, you're, what, do I look like I've been whacked into a wall? I don't know, do you? You guys tell me in the comments, do you agree? Well, I don't know. Do you feel it? Well, it's, not, it's not very nice to hope. Well, I don't even is it, know. Is it nice to call me Chef Dave? Is it nice to say all these little things that I have to ignore? Oh, are you actually no? offended by no, that? Oh now, oh, now she's playing. Oh, yeah, shut up, man. Look, when, when someone puts it on you, oh, are you actually offended? Is it nice that I have to ignore your racial comments that you say to me? Is it nice that all this sh Oh, Speedo. 
shit that you have to say I ignore and laugh it off? Oh. What is wrong with me? Nobody should have to laugh off comments like that. And on here, are you? Yeah, now, no, no, they played the victim card now, look, no, what is wrong with me? Well, and that's exactly what she's done tonight, try and play the victim card. And this Bro, what the, the fuck? The worst kind of human that could live in this world. Worst kind. Because they'd start shit and they'd play the victim. I agree. I actually fucking agree 100%. I don't really know much about Speedo. But I agree 100% with what he's just said there. That's exactly what Rachel's done today. Just found out about this live stream, played the fucking victim. Like, it's ridiculous. You're a wrong one. Ha! The shock in her eyes. She needed telling. Do you guys really think she's a narcissist? I mean, like, you know, let's put it this way, guys. Everybody thinks that they can diagnose everybody with narcissistic tendencies and narcissism and all that. It's one of the biggest words thrown around on the app. But if you do think she is, say in the comments what it is about her that makes you think that. I'll be interested to hear. I don't know how long I can react to her just being like, what the fuck? I want to move on with this clip. Because it's like six minutes long. and Unless it's more of her with somebody else. Oh. Billy. Oh, Darren. I know Darren. I don't know if Darren's following me at the moment. But me and Darren often follow each other. He's, he's a nice lad. He's funny. People wind him the fuck up. All the time, he's a nice lad. He, he raised money for charity not so long ago as well, didn't he? Um, she'll change how she acts if she's not getting the desired response. That is a trait. That is a trait. You are correct. There's a lot of you guys seem to understand the traits there that relate to her. So maybe, maybe so. Maybe so. Uh, let's see what happened here. No, come. I thought we could have a little chat and no, just no, and your racer. Okay, well, I just thought we could chat about some situations that's been no, going on. No, I don't want to talk, talk to a bully or a racist. Go on, Darren. Is you calling me overweight, a bully? Hold on, I only... I do as well, Tony. I do believe that there's something not all together up in the old brain box. Called you out after you had a go at me thing is, if people are so vulnerable that they're putting themselves at risk by, I suppose, being themselves on social media, you know, the likes of Sobriety Jack, Geordie Princess, um, Princess Flu, there's fucking loads of them. You could all say that there's something going on with them, but it's not good for them to be on social media because they end up doing shit that's horrible and then they end up getting called out on it. It's just a never-ending cycle. You know what I mean? It, it's not the place for them. Me. So I don't think so. And anyways, um, you can't fucking say that when you're the racist. Don't swear at, don't swear at me. I'm, I'm here to talk to you nicely. Well, I don't want to talk to a racist, do I? How I'm, I date women and men that are black and my barber is... Wait a minute, is she about to say a barber is black? Is black. <laughs> Fucking hell, right, okay. Guys, I'm a cis white male, right? And um, there is definitely something I've learned. You know, one of the things that I learned through the Black Lives Matter and stuff, which I think is a massively important movement, I was fucking 100% behind it, is one of the worst fucking excuses racists will make for I am not fucking racist is I know a racist, he cuts me hair. A fucking, uh, no, sorry, I know a, a black man or I know somebody of another race. They cut my hair. They fucking do this little job for me. I fucking talk to Mike at work. He's black. I can't be racist. That is like one of the most stupid fucking arguments I've ever heard in my life. It makes absolutely 
no difference whatsoever. Like, I'm a fucking barber. Me fucking. Bar oh, but it wasn't that what you said to Tyrone, was it? You mean. Oh, what did she say to Tyrone? Speedo, but okay. Oh, speedo. Um, we're not talking about that anyway. No, I well, want to come to talk like, to you. I wanted to come I'm not sticking up for her. Um, I don't want anybody to come for this person in the comments. Uh, did you know that she has autism? I don't know that she has autism, no. Uh, but like I said before, like social interaction and stuff like that, if there's an issue with social interaction, which could cause offence and backlash towards her and affect her as well as the people she interacts with, maybe her social media needs to be monitored or maybe she doesn't need to be on there speaking to people I, I, it's a really tricky subject isn't it because you don't want people's freedoms to be restricted but if it's causing us so much grief and so much hell it's probably not the best thing to be doing sitting in a box live on tiktok you know what i'm saying um and if she's got a diagnosis and she, you know what i mean she showed that fair enough but, uh, you know, self-diagnosis and stuff are, you know, people notifying or recognising in themselves that there may be a diagnosis and then going through the diagnosis process. I myself am going through an autism diagnosis, right? But I have, I'm at the very early stages. I've shown paperwork before. Um, it's... But you don't go, hey, I've got autism. Like, okay, I'll just tell everybody I've got it now. Um, you know what I'm saying? Like that, you make the you make the stage, you make the steps forward. I mean, me in my thirties, I don't know how much it'll change my life apart from the fact I have a better understanding of how my mind works at times and stuff like that. Um, but having something like that isn't a get out of jail card for being a cunt. <laughs> like it just isn't. Um, but there we go. I just wanted to come and talk to you about our situation. I don't want to talk to a bully or a racist. You... No, 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 no. Let's just clear this up, yeah? I... I never spoke to you, like, prior ten months ago. I never, ever spoke to you before. I never knew who you was. I didn't yes, know nothing you do. about you. Don't give me that shit. I'm on about before ten months ago, before this whole situation It wasn't happened. even ten months ago. Can I just say the comment there? Not all autistic people are the same. Let's not say my daughter's. Yeah, exactly. That's why it's called a spectrum. I mean, there are people who are non verbal and then look at myself hosting a live stream talking. Well, not myself. You know what I mean? I'm not diagnosed, but you know what I mean? Like, there are all sorts of things. Do you know what I mean? Me, my children, I've got a child who has ADD and I've got a child who is autistic. And there's this, the spectrums, there's crossovers all over the place. Um, the whole world, whole life, everything's a fucking spectrum. Um, yeah. Boy, you absolute loony. <laughs> okay, well, anyway, did you or did you not? Uh, I only said what I said after you come at me. No. <laughs> I like that comment. She's a proper knob. Yes. Yes, she is. Sorry. I only said that to you. She cut him off, that's why there's a bit of lag there. See, he just even said he called me overweight. <laughs> I only said that to you. Well, it doesn't matter, you still fucking said it. <laughs> like, oh! And use the same logic on yourself, Rachel. It doesn't matter, you fucking said it. You know what I'm saying? Like, the, the same fucking argument you try to put across here works for you too, Rachel. Um... value i would never listen to it you haven't done nothing to me etc etc the same old bs and now they're sat on the live looking at videos on troll pages and talking about me looking for their whoa <laughs> is this like <laughs> did we just go like into the future or some shit like just describing kind of what we're doing here and this was filmed ages ago so, this can't be the first time your shitty behaviour has been highlighted to you then. Do you know what I mean? So what did you do? Did you take responsibility for any of it? Were you like, oh, actually that was fucking bang out of order there, I need to change? Probably not. 
probably not. Don't worry if you've missed the beginning of the live stream. Um, you can always obviously watch it with us till the end and then you can go back onto YouTube, click on the live button and you'll be able to watch it again, all right? Ever dress and stalking them down and stuff like that. Like, what the fudge? They're literally the people that sit and say, oh, it's childish, blah, 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 blah. Now they're doing it. She's not affected, though. But what the hell? Oh, these people are actually, like, tapped. Like. There's a lot of friendly fire going on, really, isn't there? I don't get it. I did, and then I corrected myself after. He, he, and I said guy. I did. No, oh, I don't want to talk about a bra situation, Jesus. Hey, I'm just re really see what. I don't. I don't really get it. Thing is, you lie to people. Blah, blah, so what? Oh yeah, we've seen that clip. We've seen that clip. She does lies. She tells a lot of lies. She tells a lot of lies from what we've heard. All of these clips that are, are lagging at the start. It's like the lives being paused or something. Talked what's up? Nothing. What is going on? Talked what's up? It was a set no find that video. Talked what's up? Nothing. I don't know what's happening here? It, what's wrong then? Nothing, my love. My food's just come. Don't know. <laughs> you tell me. Obviously, it's not. For I'll just listen to the audio. Talk to what's up. Nothing. It, what, what's wrong then? Nothing, my love. My food's just come. How are you? How's TikTok? TikTok's good. Well, you look very awkward, can I just say. Shall we start a match? Oh, I wonder why she's looking awkward. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. I get trolled on you, so you might... I think Pearl followed me earlier on over on TikTok. I, I don't know who Pearl is. But now it's making sense to me why she was commenting on a few videos and stuff. I get a few comments about... Do you know what, what it's I like? I don't read them out, so don't Oh, you. no, you might just, like, they might tell you to leave or something, so... No, listen. Oh. <laughs> make your own mind up about people. Okay, thank you. And I'm not awkward. I just was... I don't know. <laughs> I get really nervous. I don't know who you are. You had 200 viewers and I was like, just, I don't know. I try and avoid like certain people on you. So I'm like, you're like the first person that I've accepted that I'm like, I'll just see. I wonder why she's trying to avoid so many people. Is she just constantly worried about being pulled up for a shitty behaviour? Stop being shitty. There you go. See, wasn't a bad shock, was it? Yeah, no, I don't, yeah, no, I know. Don't, don't worry about that. If anybody in my comments says anything, I don't even give them air time, I don't read it out, and we don't have no derogatory chat in here at all because they just get kicked straight out. Respect yeah, that. I'm all about that as well. You are awkward, yes, so I am. So tell us about yourself then. About I, me? I have seen you on here yet with them, um, I'm sure it was with, uh, who have I seen you on? Um, yes, with Ems. Yeah, that was a long time ago. A yeah. long time ago. Because Rachel will be here. Uh, so uh, what do you do? what's your name, sorry? Uh Rachel. Rachel. Well nice to meet you. I'm Pearl. Yeah, I'm just yeah. I don't really go live with anyone anymore because like I just like after that M situation I was just like yeah, I got so much backlash from that. So there was a situation between her and M's, was there? I'll search that up. What like, I hate from, 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 from her side. What do you mean? No, you just like you know what it's like. I don't really want to be known or nothing. I don't want to like have like this big following and like, but like unfortunately I I do and like. 
the fuck she got like 19,000 on fucking TikTok. I'm here to tell you, Pet, that that's really not a big following on TikTok. Like, it can be. But, like, it's not... The th but do these people not understand that so many people are hate watching? Like, they are just watching, Rachel, waiting for you to do your next big fuck-up. Your next piece of shit. So they can screen record and put it on the internet. Like, there's, there'll be so many people watching. I mean, how much support do you get, really? How many nice... You know, you have quite a few viewers you have the viewers in your live how many people are sending messages of support you know what i'm saying like it's yeah i've just lost the job and i have to move i moved in house now and it's like tiktok has literally like ruined my life <laughs> oh but it's the only it's the only place i've got to talk to people but like anyone i go live with now they you have ruined your life not tiktok Jump on the other side and start saying she was racist she was disabled she was this she's that leave 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 block her be careful she's dangerous i'm just a normal 25 year old woman so what like you tell me like because i don't listen to, if i'm gonna hear anything i want to hear it out the horse's mouth hang on a minute bitch <laughs> she's she's fucking 25 she said i was she thought i was double her age i was getting fucking personal now bitch you think i'm 50 I swear to I'm not, I know I've fucking, I can tell I've aged the three years I've been on bloody TikTok, I know that, but fucking hell, how dare, how dare, how dare you all. Like, <laughs> as much as you can. I fucking feel it. Like, tell us what happened, because I'm genuinely interested, don't think I've come on here to troll you to say out wrong, I haven't, because you can cut me off any time you want, I genuinely yeah, no, am interested. No, basically, I just came on and I was too open about my life, basically. I, I, I just came on, I'd become friends with Ems, and then I had a following, and then I was just too open about, I, I did the stupid thing and... <laughs> like, the stupid thing, like, being racist. Or mocking people with disabilities and like spoke about my whole life like everything to every detail to where then you know people find out where you live and then like it got I was stupid and then I <laughs> I've got to say I'm really enjoying Pearl's like I don't know whether Pearl thought that she was going to do this she knew who Rachel was and she wanted to have it out with her. I assume that's where it's going. But if you watch like police, like fucking interviews and that, if a suspect starts talking, shut the fuck up, let them talk. They bury themselves. They bury themselves. I've done. I'm, I mean, I'm not the best at doing it. I have done it before. Where I've just sat back, let the person I'm confronting talk, and see what happens. And it seems like that's what. Pearl is doing, whether she's doing it subconsciously or not. Um, very good. Let her dig. My banter might not be like everyone else's banter. So then I, I stupidly make the mistake of saying a couple of things to people that I shouldn't have said that I have definitely learned my lesson from now. But that doesn't, no matter how much you sit and you say I was in the wrong and you've apologised, it follows you around. So, like, it kind of reminds me of like, like I'm. I feel like I'm a bit like Brett. I don't know if you like. Yeah, yeah, boring as fuck. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> but like, I can uh, like honestly. There's just something about her voice that I think if I do the stream for more than an hour, I might fall asleep at my desk. Um, but yeah. Like Brett. Oh, what? I don't. He's a rat. Oh. Because like I he's feel like he's like in the butter. So is she, anyways. Ratty chewing. The thing is, like, people have nothing bad to say about me, but because I accidentally, I, I can't even say accidentally because I did what I said. Because, like, I'm someone that just runs my mouth, basically. I don't think before I speak. I was going live with all the big people. Maybe... If it is the thing, right? If you If you make that mistake, right? Like, oh, shit, I've said something that could be deceived as mocking a disability or not being understanding then you subconsciously think about it after that if you give a shit you're like oh no I need to educate I need to do better I need to you know what I mean like I'm sorry excuse don't wash TikTok got to my head a little bit 
and I never ever in like the year I've done this said anything wrong or done anything wrong. I literally sit here, sing, talk to people, and be. Oh God, she sings. But I, I, I fucking hope there's no clips of that. There's like two occasions where I said things to people that then now that's for it was like months and months ago and now it's just following me around and people are saying you're racist you're racist you're racist you're oh, racist it's still ongoing like obviously it's not forgot it's about my side it's just if i go live with anyone now they jump over and say that i'm racist and i have mocked disability well they can only do that if you've fucking done it like they can't do it if you haven't can they it is, but no way in my nature. No, because let me tell you something. You know, um, Bray Babby, that's what I call him because I can't even bring myself to call him his name. Yeah. I, I watched him the other day on here and sitting with his little weasel face. <laughs> sitting, sitting with his little weasel face. Jesus Christ. Pearl goes in hard. I'm laughing at this people. The woman, she moved herself back from the camera because obviously she couldn't make him understand. And yeah. he still started to laugh. Well, listen, let's hope our blessed Lord God doesn't drop something at his door. I just, like a piano on his head. I just meant, like, I think no one had a reason to hate on him. And then I think he, he said some. Well, funny you should say in the comments uh, what in the universal credit is going on here. I think she had a benefit. Stop. <laughs> so... No, nothing, <laughs> nothing. I'm afraid. Then, about someone, he related someone's, someone's no. something, and then I was I just meant like nothing like him. No, I just, listen. you know, how you just said there, nobody had a reason to hate on him. I think a lot, ninety-five percent. No, I'm just saying that he deserved it. He deserved that hate. Oh. I'm just saying he never said anything no. wrong. Then until no. that. He. Is she trying to kiss Brett's ass because she's close to M's? Like, is that the crack? Went on with poor Helen. Yeah. And went on about her child who's asleep peacefully in heaven now. And he oh, is the Christ. dirtiest little lowlife yeah. piece of rubbish. That Whoa, did Brett say something about somebody's dead child? Wow, I didn't know that. I didn't fucking know that. That's no, I just meant like no one had anything against me, and then as soon as I said what I said, it's like because I never. I it's like, like, listen, I like to know what like about people. I do not listen or to what anybody else says. Yeah. Like, what did you did you say in a roundabout way? If you can say it. So I don't know if you know Speedo is. So basically, there's two mistakes that I made on TikTok. Two. Let's let's hear her. Let's hear her try and justify these mistakes and and this is the only two i've ever made and people say i denied it but like i haven't i know i said it and i know it happened but the way people are making it out that like i'm some sort of like horrible person like and racist when so what like, did you say so basically i was on with speedo me somebody tagged me in that clip about brett on tiktok i'm gonna do some sort of video about it speedo were fine we were friends for a while we were, he was, it, before I said what I said, we were talking about, like, his culture. We were talking about his language. He was teaching me. Um, he was teaching me words in, I don't even want to say it because I don't want to say it wrong again because I don't want to go down that road. But the language he speaks and all like that, we were bantering and all like, and all like that. And, like, we were, uh, in a battle, and then um, I think I had like There's some great fucking internet at the end of this. A like win streak of like. There must be a part two, yeah. Oh, Christ, looks like they do videos on everybody. Um, a few Rachel Skinner ones on here as well. I'll check out. But where was that? Pearl part one, part two. There we go. Do that because. No oh, we're going to see the move this time. No, listen, even I'm backward. And listen, I can't say people's names right or anything, but personally, me myself, like, that was just as bad as, like, 
Brave Abby. Do you know what I'm saying? You do not make fun of people's cultures, the religion, the <laughs> colour of the skin, the essence. Listen, but to me, looking that from that... Was yes. I take it, Mick, that was me just reacting to him beats oh, no, like that was back. So Doesn't matter. Bad on such a low level, that was a real below the belt kick in the teeth. And, like, if I'd have been, like, speed all there, oh, I'd have flipped all together, I don't know what happened, because I didn't see... He didn't flip, he just said to me to don't say it to anyone else. He was like... Because I thought, I generally thought it was a country. I was like, oh. Guys, just a quick message. If you're not following me on YouTube, please hit that follow button. I am so close to 10K, honestly. If you like this kind of content, also there's lots of stuff that you're missing if you've never been on my YouTube channel before. We have deep dives, thorough investigations on some of your creators, as well as these live streams and awareness posts. So please, if you're enjoying, hit that thumbs up. Oh, I thought it was a country, but then he was, he, we literally, he was, he was like, oh, like, just don't say it to anyone else. And then a few days later, he was angry about it. And then we just haven't spoken since, but. I would have been angry right from the start. Because I, I, I'm was, angry at myself, trust me. <laughs> gentleman on this app. and I... You're not angry with yourself. You're just trying to justify yourself for like eight minutes. I promise you. And that's my answer, the blessed Lord God. There's two people, like really two good lads who's always on this app and one of them is Speedo and I absolutely adore him and it's I couldn't good. think of a nicer person so far to say something like that to him. My <laughs> opinion is well, that was so, so, so loathable and disrespectful. And I watched Speedo for like two years before that situation happened and I was stupid and got myself involved with people that had a following. Another thing that you don't, if you don't mind us asking. Oh, this guy, this guy. So she's trying to justify, obviously, uh, what, like, mocking Speedo's culture yeah. in some way, which is absolutely vile. Um, and now she's going to try and justify her other mistake, let's say. I harassed, I'm, I'm, well, I'm thinking of going live with him just because I've had enough of people saying I was mocking disabilities. Um, we were mocking what? Apparently I was mocking disabilities, even though I've... I so tell us a story on that then, please. Oh, basically some guy in a wheelchair on here. I'm really impressed with Pearl. I, I, like, I've never watched Pearl before. Good, good on you, Pearl. I don't know if you're in here, but good on you. Who, may I add, I supported for a long time when he was in hospital and everything. When she cries, there are never any tears. Her eyes are drier than the Sahara Desert. And how she switches from breaking down to hysterical and back to normal in less than a second it's actually quite scary there's quite a few creators that do that sort of shit jade and it's all to get me to play the pink violin that's all they're doing it's on hand guys it's ready i just know there's going to be a moment for it i just know and um he had harassed me for a month and a half before I'd even snapped and said anything, was looking for a reaction off me for ages, mm. slandered my name everywhere, told everyone I was a shit person, everything possible before I'd even said anything. Kind of acting like a shit person though, when you're like, people can't just, like, people have tried calling me a shit person, for example, but there's been no evidence to back it up. But like calling you a shit person, for example, there is evidence, we've watched quite a bit of it. Well, that, this, this, these things happened like eight months ago, eight nine months ago. This was like before. Like, when you think, like what was said, do you know? That, do you know? Oh what yeah, that? basically, he was piping up to me in the comments. And something I say to people if they're piping up is pipe up and sit back down. That's something that I've always said. But me, I thought in my head, and I've learned my lesson. Trust me, fucking hell, in my head, and I was like, oh, yeah, I know. Just pipe down and sit back down in your wheelchair. Pearl, let him out. Let let him have it. Sorry, let her have it. So you did. You knew what you were saying to say. Sit back down in your wheelchair because if I didn't know I was saying something, I would just have said. Exactly. The insult was planned to include the disability. Can we get like a round of applause in the chat for Pearl? Like, because that is a brilliant observation to pull on her. You would you adjusted your insult 
to include his disability. That means you thought about it and you thought about something that you could say to hurt that person using their disability. Brilliantly said, Pearl. What are they? No, you wouldn't have mentioned the wheelchair. What's your name, Rachel? Did you yeah. say? Yeah, but I. But the thing is, if you knew me as a person and knew it was generally out of anger, and I, I, I had a lot. Out of anger doesn't justify it. What shit it for it. All, so you really basically admitted it was out of anger. There you go. No, so not you knew what you were saying. So it's no good going around the streets. And I'm not going. No, I'm not. I've admitted it. I've not never denied it. I know I said it, and I've learned my lesson. Yes, Pearl. And that's why now I don't involve myself with TikTok people because I can't be bothered to make this mistake again. I am a nice person and I... You're not a nice person that if you get angry, you go for the the worst thing you can think of um, that could upset that person, i.e. their disability, their race, their religion, where they're from, anything like that. Have done nothing. Can I just can I just say, listen, first time I've ever met I give a sweet talk about the things I have done. I thought I was only going to be reacting an hour here, but I tell, we're going to end up going long, guys. Don't worry. On this app, then should we talk about the things I have done? <laughs> I don't think them things, personally, myself, was done by accident. Because, firstly, Agreed. listen, if I was on there... Who in the chat thinks that Rachel said something about this person's wheelchair by accident? Who agrees with that in the comments? There's 500 odd of you in here. What do you think? Not everyone has to speak, but if you want to speak, who agrees, who doesn't agree? Uh, with you, go... If she is watching, she may be able to see, and if she sees all of these people putting on their opinion, she might think, actually, shit, you know what I mean? Come back to speed, or if I was on there with you and that, you wouldn't have said to me something that, because, clearly, just because of the colour of my skin, you'd never have dreamed in a million years. I, I wouldn't have mentioned that, colour, that culture. You're twisting it, though. No, I never... She's not twisting a damn thing. Whoever did the screen recording needs to get the Wi-Fi sorted. I date black, I date black men and black women. Don't forget to tell her your barber's black, Jesus. Don't leave that out. Once Pearl hears your barber's black, I'm sure she'll just be like, all right, no problem. Why didn't you fucking say? That culture, and you couldn't have said it to a nicer person that's on the side. He's a pure gentleman, and a million percent, he didn't deserve that. And secondly, whichever poor person that's got that disability in a wheelchair, you like, um, Rare Babby on here, he's good at mocking people with disabilities. And then, that that wasn't mocking. when it doesn't go his way, and like a little snake on his belly, and really, you're the first time I've come across you, but you want to know something? I don't think I'd ever, ever, like, want to come on a, on a live with you again, because firstly, you're so disrespectful, and... Who do you think you are mocking disabled people? Mocking mock you know, people is... You have to go through life yet. Absolutely big up to Pearl here. Pearl is going in and good on her. That's not mocking people. Through life yet. I have been through a lot in my life. You don't know nothing about my life. The Lord God is going to put... She said she's gone through a lot in her life. How much of that stuff that you've gone through has been caused by you, Rachel? God... You do not know, and to me, it's very ignorant, childish, and yeah. yes, uh, yeah, childish. like rais racism. That yeah, but it's childish, but it's not yeah. So to me, you know the definition of mocking, being with ratty, and no accountability at all. With rare boy, you like you know like the little rat pack that that like that that, that to me. Do you know? Do you know the definition of mocking? Big, I'm disgusted that I'm even on here when such likes as you are still on this app. Love it. You and your little friend, absolutely disgusting. Can I just say? Did she just end the battle as well? Do you know what? Big respect to Pearl because that shows absolutely no. Pardon me, no selling out whatsoever. As soon as she identified what sort of person she was, she cut the live battle, which meant that obviously she's going to lose the wins that she had saved up and everything like that. But that is voting with your feet, and that is like, yeah, these are my morals, and actually, yeah, I'm fucking out of here. 
much respect honestly absolutely much respect um i just want to highlight something as well i did see that rachel has a tattle thread now i have a love-hate relationship with tattle um tattle would be great if you guys made a comment you know like have you seen that she was racist and then put a video that would be brilliant uh, i have used it for information and stuff before it looks like it was only set up yesterday which i'm surprised but there's a couple of videos on here so we'll watch them as well um i'm not going to read through it uh there's one here let's see what this is apparently what a vile cretin for singing i'd catch a grenade for you to your ukrainian girl uh, and then continues to insult her at the end. Now I can't actually watch this because it's probably got the song on, so it'll probably copyright it. But you guys know where you can go to watch it. Um, this is one of many discriminatory things she has said. This was after a Lucy Spraggan content um, concert. Sorry, on her way home. Let's see what was said. Let's see what was said. <laughs> Bloody hell, I might be overweight, but I'm not fucking disabled. Who was she? Who were you? <laughs> who the fuck were you angry at then? Because apparently you only say these sort of things when you're angry. What the hell does this even mean? Don't worry, we're not finished watching stuff on TikTok. I just wanted to bring this up. <laughs> Bloody hell, I might be overweight, but I'm not fucking disabled. Good God. Good God. Um, right. I don't know if there was another video here. Being horrible to Darren because he called her out for being racist to Speedo. So we'll have a little look at that. But like I say, I don't know. I know quite a few people obviously use Tattle. It might interest you to know that there is a Tattle thread about her. Um, Darren, you can fuck up. <laughs> what are you on about? To be fair, I'm not 100% sure, but isn't this guy who was sticking up for the, the wrong ones the other week? Oh, guys, thank you for the blue hearts. I just realised what you are doing. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. I really do. <laughs> Go back fucking city field, Fuck off. I'm gonna end up saying something that I will. You're just quite switched on Mary Dodge McFly. I am actually gonna end up saying something like Well, that was underwhelming. But there we go. So she does have a tattle life if you want to check it out. I'm going to have a look at this account now as well because there was a few, look, there's a few videos here with her um, going right back. So I'm just going to click on some random ones and see what's going on. Uh, do, 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 do. What's happening here? We would make cute kids together. Oh, God. Just clicked on this as random. Like, this is nearly as bad as the moist video. Like, they'd come out with like blue hair. How cool is that? I know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that would be well cool. I ain't cool. worried about it. So, when I'll can look we for date? that, the benefits. That's a bit forceful. Thank y'all for the likes. Tap the screen and share the live. Let's go. She's vile to him, really creepy. Right, let's just Seems smoke him it. for the sake of smoking him. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Yeah, yeah, you're bringing so much smoke there when you're fucking 25, 27 or whatever. What, there's innuendos? No way. Yes, I remember her crying about being reported. I'll have to have a look for that. Give us a second. We will we will react to this. We'll react to this. I just need to go to and we'll Because otherwise my bloody mind I'll forget about that. Uh I've not mentioned it. That's it, is it? 
it's not I'm not on my account if mods want to send it to me on uh, Instagram I'll have a look at it this is just weirdly fucking I ain't reacting to a silent video like I just want a conversation with you bro yeah, well, he does a mod mod with That's you. That's all I want. You're a man of many words. You see, I'm, you know, believe it or not, I'm quite socially awkward. And I, I think if somebody was to, like, sit and be like, come on then, talk. Like, that's just going to make me, like, be more shut up and more uncomfortable. Um, do 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 Big shout out to the mod team as well on YouTube, you guys rock. We've seen the Pearl one. I'm wondering if there's any others on here that I haven't seen. The most recent one by her. Deal timing, but I wouldn't really care if it did happen. I definitely would be happy. So this was a day ago. I don't have any kids, no. Nope. Oh, you got five girls, one boy. Oh my god. And I feel like girls are more argumentative. If that's the right word. The word beginning with a B and ending with the Y, with itchy in the middle of it. But yeah. Yeah, let's have a look at this benefits thing like I've not mentioned it how long are you sanctioned who said I was sanctioned I've not mentioned it I've not mentioned anything <laughs> don't even know why people are she misgendered someone yesterday I mean I just called her a dude earlier on or a guy I mean <laughs> I mean I made a mistake you know what I mean it wasn't an intentional thing um so did Lou look at the chain reaction recording? I can't watch any music ones on here. She lied about an abortion. Fuck me. Um, let's see if I can find something to do with that then. Did Lou do? Great spelling as always. The fuck is this? Not that one, thank you. Right, okay, we'll see what this is first. This benefits We're talking one. about it. We're talking about money or anything. I literally have not mentioned it. Does she actually make a, a decent amount of money on TikTok? Because you've got to make a decent amount of money before it affects your benefits. I've not mentioned it. I've not spoken about it. Literally. Not even mentioned it. this one um the police <laughs> well she's she said the police are watching this video as well uh today so can everybody say hello to the police who are apparently watching my live stream the what is a thousand a week from tiktok fuck off he's doing oh, the same how rachel back at it again. um the police have Told you to fuck off. Stop reporting random bullshit. Contacted my ex and my ex has been advised that they have to take all the videos down about me and they are not allowed to mention me as all the evidence I've provided. 
I hope she got her solicitors involved as well. They work any day. Is harassment. Um, if is it though? Anything else does continue, then I believe it's probably all lies. That person will be nicked, and they have been told that they will be arrested. No, they wouldn't. Um, the police officer has also told me that that person is going to go live to tell... <laughs> oh, get the fuck The police officer has arranged a live stream where they're going to go live <laughs> and tell them, I've been a very, very naughty person. Mr. Policeman says I need to come live on TikTok and let you all know just how bloody silly I've been. What are you talking about? Is that literally what she's going to say? This is the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. Her followers about the situation. So I just wanted to kind of come on and talk about the situation. Um, I spent three days in a police station down in Wales. Three days? What, were you remanded? Like, what the fuck are you talking about? How did you spend three days in a police station? Um, to be told that nothing could be done. <laughs> what do you mean, nothing could be done? Apparently she's fucking got a host of live stream. Um, so I went out of my way and got myself a solicitor. That's right, I that's from the UK. Oh, Annie, thank you so much for that donation. Thank you got in contact with Kent Police. Kent Police then asked me to send a file through. I then took it upon myself to go to my local library. In what? <laughs> and do what? <laughs> I then took it upon myself to go to the local library, read as many fucking detective dramas as I could, get really together on what a police investigation was and get into... What are you talking about? I love for, for I honestly I live for dumb shit like this because this is so fucking easy to break down and, and call it out. You know what I mean? Is this Elvis? Print out everything I had. And All right, okay. Why would you be printing it out when you you email <laughs> you fucking email the police? You don't send them a fucking what like a bloody box full of print offs. Are you okay? And I took it to Kent Police. Why? They then... Threw it in the fucking bin? Went out to my ex's property yesterday and she was... Got her a tripod and a ring light ready for the live stream. <laughs> not there. Um, I thought you spoke to them. How, how was she not there then? I then had a phone call about an hour ago from the officer... And the officer said, can you stop calling me? <laughs> told me that she admitted it. She admitted being a part of the page. She admitted being the page. She also told the officer how <laughs> it was four years ago that we were together and there's no reason for what she's doing. Um, the officer said that... The officer had to shout at her because she sounded like she was not listening. <laughs> now, don't worry. I've I've given her a good shouting to. That is one of the. You know what I mean? Like we can't, we can't uh, arrest. We can't arrest. We can't ask for a voluntary interview. We can't do anything like that. But we've told her she's going to go on live on TikTok and I've given her a good shout too. So hopefully the message will have got through. I mean, <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> this is the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. And the officer basically told her that she's going to get nicked if it goes any further. Um... The officer did also tell me that she is going to go live to a, just to say no more, like enough is enough. <laughs> and that's why I'm coming live just now to... Um, to get us all ready for the big live stream that probably never fucking happened. Kind of. I know uh, Pandora and that's all good. 
ear out the shit that I've had and to ear out um, just kind of what the situation is. For the last two weeks I've had phone calls after phone calls with the police. I've had six officers out to my house <laughs> and an ambulance. What the fuck was the ambulance there for? Um, and is the ambulance on standby for the live stream with the fucking defibs? I don't, I'm like, what? Hopefully, that is the end of it. And hopefully, we could all my be ex off. has been told she's been shouted at, remember that she has to remove the page and the oh, really? I didn't know that she'd done that. That's vile videos, otherwise she's going to be arrested for the harassment that she has caused. Uh, right, okay, I've got a... If a police officer ever comes to you, because it does happen, and threatens you, I'm going to arrest you, ask them why they're not now. And a police officer, a good police officer, should never threaten an arrest, they would just make an arrest. You know what I mean? You can have a warning from the police where they can speak to you, it's unofficial. It's as good as me giving you advice and fucking cover for anything. But if a, a cop's never going to be like, well, I'm going to arrest you in a darn minute. No, they will just arrest you. Like For me. So, anyone that thinks bullying online, screen record. The police would be in trouble, it would be on their body cam and it would just be, that, that would be harassment from the police. Some people are making videos about it. Well, Anyone who thinks that... I'm doing one now, Rachel. I look forward to a shout at by the police. It's funny. Oops. Um, it is dealt with seriously and I hope that anyone else that ever goes through what I've been through for the last two or three weeks is strong enough to speak out like I have um, if it makes me a grass going to the police and doing what I've done it doesn't because you had nothing to grass like <laughs> I mean if you if, if, you know, if there was a conviction or an actual crime that took place, then maybe people could call you that. But at this point, you're just a nosy Nora or a fucking knobhead ringing the police for no reason. Then I'll happily... Good, Janine, good, good. I'm glad it's been... Because the thing is, like, this is what's different about the, the a deep dive, obviously, live reaction. We're just live reacting along. We're trying to sort of laugh at it as well as raise awareness a little bit. I mean, with shit like this, it's too hard not to take the piss out of it because it's absolutely ridiculous. Take that label. Um. Yeah, the police took the other half of her hair in the fucking divorce. <laughs> I nearly took my life a couple of weeks ago. Again with the threats. Again with the threats. We've already had that today as well, haven't we? That is called mental manipulation. Um... And I had the ambulance service to make a statement of that. Um, I knew. I knew. That's why I had it right here today. I knew. I knew it was time. You know what I'm saying? It was, I knew it was going to be appropriate. Doesn't sound like there was a case. Fucking idiot. I kind of explained to the officer that I was scared that it would kind of, I don't know, make things worse. Um, but that's the situation. I'm not going to talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> we are, how, how many minutes? I'm not going to talk about it. This is an 8 minute 29 clip. Are you bloody talking about it? What the fucking... What? 
I'm not going to talk about it, guys. You know that thing we've been talking about for the last eight minutes. My ex and her friends and family aren't allowed to talk about it. Otherwise, they have been told that they will get arrested because the things that they have done is harassment. And is it though? I sent a massive file of stuff to the officers nearly two weeks ago. What did you do with your printout? <laughs> she doesn't deserve an Oscar. Isn't there an award for like uh, flops? There is, isn't there? Like really bad acting. Um, and yeah, but the officer has told me that she is planning to go live. <laughs> now it sounds like she's talking about the police officer. It'll go something like this. Hi. I'm the police officer who keeps getting phone calls from Rachel fucking Skinner. Uh, I have now quit the force. I cannot deal with this bullshit anymore. I'm going crazy. So now I'm trying for the weekly rankings. Like, <laughs> like. And she is planning to tell everyone to apparently not talk about it. Whether that's going to backfire on me or not. If I've got to go through the same... It's not going to backfire on you, is it? You haven't got a kiss. Some shit that I have for three weeks for her. I'll happily do it to everyone else. I'm all for police talk, like. Get more police officers on TikTok. Get them bloody live streaming their body cams while they go to people's houses like this. That she is surrounded with. Um... Can we get some blue hearts in the chat for the ex, who clearly is just, you know tried to speak out against this person i understand this person falsely accused them of grip and all sorts of things publicly on social media uh, and they've clapped back do you know what i mean which you fucking would do wouldn't you so fuck them yeah that's basically it um for the what the police are concerned down that way i can't believe she's got an ex to be honest is that she has been warned to leave me alone. She is warned to stop posting videos about me and making edits of me. I'm stuck on a bush. And um, fingers crossed, that's the last. <laughs> Can anybody just point out that this is not crossing your fingers? Like, the fuck is that? Scouts on her. Like, what the hell is this? Fingers crossed, guys. Fingers crossed. What? Asked of it. I wish her the absolute best. Ha! <laughs> I wish her the best for the live stream later. I hope it goes well. In life. <laughs> with her kids. With herself. With her new relationship. There's no hard feelings from my side. I just want... There's no hard feelings on your side, but apparently you've got a big police case against her and you can't talk about it in case you ruin the case. What the hell are you talking about? She to be left alone and not harassed and stalked and threatened and blackmailed and... Um... I... I don't wish anything... Fingers crossed, guys. ...bad on... on her. Um, and I'm proud of myself for not over, like for not kicking off, and I've kept myself calm, and I have not got anyone else involved. I've not had anyone else to bitch about her. I've not had anyone else get like get involved. You're on a live stream talking about her, you absolute clown. Um, right, guys, I think that's that's where I'm going to leave it for today. That's where I'm going to leave it for today. Uh, that was an introduction for me to Rachel Skinner. And what do I think of Rachel Skinner? Um, I don't think she should be on social media um, because it seems to be doing her more damage than good and affecting a hell of a lot of other people. Um I know that there's going to be a hell of a lot more to see about her. I know that for sure. Um, just because I've done a live reaction of her doesn't mean that I won't do another in the future. Um, but this is... 
Yeah, that was that was one hell of an eye opener. That was one hell of an eye opener. I understand I've only scratched the surface. Um, hopefully, her realizing that you know when people Google your name now, Rachel, this video is going to come up on Google, for example. Like your behaviour needs to change. You need to either change or get off social media because your bad behaviour, you ain't going to be able to escape it. More and more people are going to hold you accountable for it. Quite rightly, when you are angrily attacking people for their disabilities, their race, their religion, whatever the hell it is. Um, absolutely crazy. And now the boring bit. Thank you very much, guys, for obviously coming and watching this live stream with me. It means the fucking world. If you enjoyed it, please hit that follow button. Uh, we're close to 10k on here, and I can't believe we've made it nearly to 10k in just less than a year. Um, don't forget as well my Patreon as well. You search the Fact Free Patreon on Google or my link tree. Uh, for two quid a month, you can watch some of my YouTube videos before they go live on YouTube. Um, honestly, I appreciate everybody's support. You guys are fucking awesome. Oh, Denise, thank you so much. <laughs> now go grab a pint. I'd fucking love to. I really would. Thank you very much, Denise. Um, but honestly, it means the world to me that you guys came along. The chat's been really nice and positive as well. Very respectful. Big shout out to the mods as well.